Hello everyone, this is Jack from Dr. Bruce App. Welcome back to the part 3 of the video where we're going to show you the road test for this uh, Prius plug-in with Nexel battery. Uh, yesterday we finished the installation, it was a chaos. It's so much trouble to shoot a video and do the prototyping at the same time. Especially when this is the very first prototype, there's a lot of things going went wrong. We have to correct it behind the scene. So it was a tiring yesterday, so finally got some rest and back uh, back to uh, do the video. And today we're going to show you the the EV wrench test. This is going to be my first time as well. Uh, I haven't even got energy to try it out. So I'll bring you with me to explore what the, the mileage is going to be with the Nexel, bigger Nexel lithium battery in the previous plug-in. Stay tuned. All right, let's fire out the car. And Dr. Precept, charge complete. I'm gonna reset the trip computer to zero miles right here. 15.8 miles to go. That's why he says, state of charge 85%. That's good. All right, let's do it. Here you go guys, it's a super boring long ride and we are at, we have traveled at 25.5 miles and when comparing to the star battery, the star battery total range is 11.5 so we are looking at more than double the EV range of the star battery and take a look at the MPG, the MPG is 962 MPG <laughs> of course it's crazy. Let's take a look at the number. Uh, the battery temperature at 90, nice and nice and toast. Um, everything looks fine. Delta volt, volt diff is only 0.07. It feels like the car still can go, but the indicator has switched from the plug-in indicator to the regular hybrid system indicator. That's why I decided to stop. Otherwise, I could travel another mile or two. Uh, condition wise the ambient temperature is 58 so I don't have my AC on um, the traffic wise uh, 
this is one of those days you keep hitting all the red lights. So I feel like the entire trip I was waiting for traffic lights. It's super boring. But I, I'm glad we made it. That's why at the end I actually turn into an airport. I go along the airport to avoid all the traffic uh, traffic lights. Alright, and that's pretty much it. This is just the first test. Uh, to push this product to the market, we need to do more testing, endurance testing, and torture testing as well. So the plug-in upgrade battery should be available in about a couple of months to, to half year. That's usually the development and testing cycle. So I'm, I'm super grateful that you guys stay with me for this uh, journey and the super long ride. Yeah, uh, please hit that subscribe. I'll definitely see you at the next one. Cheers.